हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू कलर मीडिया वंस अगेन माय नेम इज गुलशन शाह फ्रेंड्स इन टुडे वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू कवर व्हाट आर द ऑप्शंस अवेलेबल इन गवर्नमेंट कॉलेजेस इन डीएनबी एंड प्राइवेट एंड डीम्ड यूनिवर्सिटीज फॉर ऑल दोज स्टूडेंट्स स्कोरिंग मार्क्स बिटवीन 400 टू 500 येस्टरडे वी हैव पब्लिश्ड अ वीडियो इन व्हिच वी discussed about students expecting marks between 500 to 600 and above so today we are going to cover all those options which are available in front of students expecting marks between 400 to 500 so this is the mark range, uh, marks range of completely 100 we have divided in, uh, it into four uh, categories that is the first category is uh, the students expecting marks between 475 to Uh, 500 then the second category is uh, the students expecting marks between 450 to 475 third one is 425 to 450 and fourth one is 400 to 425 and for each and every uh, sub categories will be discussing that what are the options available uh, what are the uh, what are the, they have what are the options they have in government colleges in dnb in nb diploma and also in private or deemed so let's start the video Uh, before going ahead i would like to uh, uh, give you some information if you wanted to attend the zoom meeting which we conduct uh, which we regularly uh, conducting and we are discussing on the opportunity on the options available in front of you at the marks you are expecting in the neat pg exam so what are the options available in front of you what, are, what will be the fee structure uh, how you should proceed with the counseling what should be your backup option uh, what are the options you should keep uh, for your profile Uh, according to your requirement what is the bond condition what are the st stipend over there uh, so these are these are the things which are um, thoroughly uh, discussing in our zoom meeting so if you also wanted to attend the zoom meeting which is completely free need not to pay any uh, any uh, amount for that you can just fill up the form given in the description box that is a zoom meeting form at the same time if you want to be a updated with the counseling information with the 2020 need page 2022 uh, updates news or uh, other details which we are sharing with other students you can join our tele telegram group the gro the link for the group is also given in the description box at the same time you have uh, our number flashing on the screen you can call us or whatsapp us to ask any doubt or query let's start the video uh, as i told you the first category is the students who are expecting marks between 475 to 500 right so we have five types of colleges right first one is government college in which two types are there through all india quota and through state quota so two uh, two types are there two, uh, two types of counseling uh, for getting government college then the third one is private call uh, then the third one is dnb fourth one is nb diploma fifth one is private sixth one is deemed so we are going to cover for all of, for all the other all the options what you have first government colleges government colleges for all india quota if you if you come under general category ews category or obc category uh, you will be getting lower clinical branches lower clinical uh, branches uh, means uh, uh, the branches like anesthesia ent ophthal these are the branches which you can get in So, uh, in mdms through all india quota if you come under general ews or obc right if you come under sc you will be having all the options available in mdms through all india quota except radio and dharma if you come under st category all the branches are available for you you can get any of the branches whichever you want right so that means radio and dharma also available for you if you uh, if you are coming under st category and your marks is between which you are expecting is between 475 to 500 right similarly come to the state quota this, this was the this was all about all india quota option now state quota in state quota for general category anesthesia and radio therapy is possible uh, though, uh, these two branches would be uh, available for general category through their state in their state through state quota for ews and obc lower clinical branches would be available for sc except radio and dharma all the other branches would be available for st all the branches would be available through state quota now come to the if you if you not getting your uh, desirable branch in mdms and you have the option of dnb then in dnb for general ews and obc 
higher clinical are not possible you will uh, i mean uh, higher clinical branches would not be available uh, first thing i would like to tell you that uh, rank range between 475 to 500 means the uh, i mean marks range between 475 to 500 means rank range would come around 18k to 24k right uh, as you go closer to 500 your rank would be somewhere approximately 18000 and if you come towards 475 it your rank would uh, get increase and it will come around 2400 so at this mark the rank range would come uh, uh, between 18k to 24k right so on this rank range only we are talking on this marks range we are talking so for as i told you that higher clinical are not possible for general ews and obc in dnb right for uh, higher clinical means radio derma medicine pediatrics these are the branches these are not possible in um, even obg these are not possible in uh, dnb right but for sc category only radio derma is not po- are not possible whereas all the other branches are possible in dnb right for st all the branches are possible for nbe diploma for general ews and, and obc only radio will not be available rest of the branches will be available if you wanted to take diploma course right for sc same radio is not uh, will not be possible all the other branches will be possible and for st all the branches would be possible now there is a condition that i don't want to take dnb so if you don't want to go for dnb and you are not getting your desirable branch in mdms government in that case but but still you want to uh, 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 you want to go for mdms you you don't have the option of dnb in that case you will have to go for the private colleges or deemed universities right so in private colleges in semi government in semi government higher clinical would not be available for you higher clinical means radio derma medicine pedia obgyva these are the branches these branches will not be available in semi government just say that in maharashtra semi government having a fee structure of 7 lakh 8 lakh sorry 8 lakh 9 lakh 10 lakh like that right uh, in uh, uh, in uh, karnataka the fee structure for semi government is uh, uh, 7 lakh approximately 7 lakh right so for semi government seats these branches upper higher clinical would not be possible in private colleges we know that the semi government means the government seat available in private colleges right that's why whenever we are talking about private colleges we are first taking the uh, government seats available in private colleges for that uh, higher clinical would not be possible for higher clinical your fees will come around 20 lakhs per annum and uh, that means means if you if you're scoring marks between 475 to 500 and you want higher clinical and higher clinical as you are not getting in md ms government seats and you don't want to go for the uh, dnb or nbe diploma in that case you will have to go for the private now in the private the fee structure for you guys for higher clinical radio derma medicine pediatrics obg for these branches the minimum fees will come around 20 lakhs per annum and the states where you can get will will be up uh, himachal uttarakhand um, the um, pondicherry west bengal these these are the states where you can get where you can easily get right so these are the branches okay now uh, come to the mid clinical mid for mid clinical your fees will come 8 lakh 64000 per annum for lower clinical uh, it will be the lower fees only it starts from 6 lakh so on 6 lakh only lower cl- uh, clinical you will get right so for deemed university higher clinical above 25 lakh per annum if you wanted to take, if you don't want to go for any state like up himachal uh, uh, uttarakhand these states you don't want to go you want to go for deemed university because deemed universities are some of the deemed universities are very good deemed universities and they get timely stipend uh, and they have good reputation i mean uh, there are only few deemed university which are not good other deemed universities are very Uh, very good like uh, the deemed universities available in maharashtra deemed universities available in tamil nadu in karnataka those are the, those are the uh, very uh, good deemed universities so if you don't want to go for private uh, you want to go for uh, you have option of deemed university but you know one thing whatever branch you are getting in private in whatever fee structure deemed will come comparatively in higher fee structure than private colleges so in deemed for higher clinical branches your fees will be approximately 25 lakh per annum for higher clinical it will go above 25 lakh per annum for mid clinical uh, uh, like surgery and other branches uh, it will come uh, it will be around 20 lakhs per annum 
or more than that, one lakh, two lakh, uh, uh, you can consider it can more than twenty lakh. For lower clinical, it will come around thirteen lakh per annum. Now come to the second range, which is uh, the students scoring marks between four fifty to four seventy five. So uh, the students scoring marks between four fifty to four seventy five, the rank uh, uh, range would be somewhere between twenty four thousand to thirty two thousand rank, right? So we are talking about that rank range, that marks range. For government. In government, in all through all India quota for general category only non-clinical would be would be available for EWS and OBC lower clinical would be available for SC except radio and dermal all the other branches would be available for ST all the branches would be available through state quota for general EWS and OBC only non non-clinical would be available for ST lower clinical would be available and for ST higher clinical uh, except higher clinical other branches would be available like radio dermal medicine pedia other branches. Uh, would be uh, available. Yes, in DNB for general category, ortho surgery and lower clinical would be available. For EWS and OBC quota, higher clinical not possible. Whereas all the other branches would be available. For SC except radio dermal, all the other branches would be available in DNB. For ST, all the branches would be available. In NBE diploma for general EWS and OBC. Radio is not possible. Whereas other branches are possible for SC and ST, all the branches would be available, right? Now, if you don't want to take DNB, obviously, and you are not getting the desirable branch in MDMS through All India or the state, in that case, you will have to move forward towards uh, private or DIM. So, in a private, in semi-government, lower clinical would be possible. That is the government seat available in private colleges, right? The, having a fee structure less than management seat and more than government seat, right? So in semi-government, only lower clinical would be possible. For higher clinical, you will have to opt for the state where the fees will come around 22 lakhs per annum or above 22 lakhs. So what are all those those states which can give you higher clinical? Those states are UP, Himachal, West Bengal, Uttarakhand, uh, Rajasthan. On each of these, these are the states where you, you can get upper clinical branches. For the rest of the branches, you will be getting in the lower fee structure only. I mean, for mid clinical, you can get uh, you can you can get mid clinical within eight lakh sixty four thousand rupees per annum, and that fee is of Andhra Pradesh. You can get in Andhra Pradesh. For lower clinical, you can get uh, in six lakh also that is available in Bihar. Okay, but if you don't want to go for private. But still, you want to go for deemed. In deemed higher clinical, for higher clinical, your fees will be more than thirty lakhs per annum. For higher clinical means radio, derma, medicine, pedia, these branches, right? For mid clinical, your fees would be somewhere approximately twenty five lakhs per annum or more than that. And for lower clinical, thirteen lakhs per annum in deemed. Now come to the marks range between 425 to 450, which is our third category, and the rank range will come between 32k to 40k. Okay. In in government, what are you, what are your options? In government, through all India quota for general EWS and OBC category, non-clinical are possible. For SC, higher clinical are not possible. Other branches are possible. For ST, except radio, all the branches will, would be available. Now through state quota for general EWS and OBC only non-clinical would be available. For SC, lower the clinical would be available. Lower clinical means anesthesia, ENT. Up till these branches would be available for ST. Higher clinical are not possible. Uh, mid clinical and lower clinical would be available for ST category. Right now, come to the DNB option for you. Now you have DNB option like for general category EWS and OBC non clinical are possible in DNB. For SC, higher clinical are not possible. Other branches are possible for SC category. Higher clinical means radio, dermal medicine. These branches are not possible. Where as other branches are possible for SC, all the branches would be possible. If in NBE diploma for general EWS and OBC, lower clinical are possible. For SC, radio is not possible. Other branches are possible for SC, all the branches are possible. Right now, if you don't want to go for DNB or NBE diploma. And you are not getting your desirable branch in MDMS through all India quota or the state. In that case, you have to go forward, move forward towards private or deemed. Now, in the private, in semi-government, you would be getting lower clinical. 
for higher clinical if you wanted to take higher clinical you have to opt for the state which is having a fee structure of approximately 22 lakh 23 lakhs or more than that and those states are obviously same up himachal uh, uttarakhand uh, west bengal these are the states where you can apply pondicherry in south so these are the states where you can get the higher clinical branch for rest of the branches like middle uh, mid clinical or lower clinical it will come around 15 lakhs per annum around i mean do, in those states only or the states like in bihar uh, there the fee structure would come approximately it varies from 6 lakh to 15 lakhs so for lower clinical uh, you will be getting in uh, 15 lakhs per annum if you don't want to go for a state states like up bihar or himachal or northern side or private colleges you you have the option of deemed but deemed are relatively costlier than private colleges so in deemed for higher cl clinical you you will have to opt for the colleges having a fee structure more than 35 lakh for higher clinical for higher clinical means obviously radio dharma medicine pedia these are the branches right um and it is possible huh, these are the branches where you you, you should go uh, where your fees could come uh, more than 35 lakhs so for mid clinical your fees in deemed university you will have to keep and uh, keep your options for the colleges having a fee structure of 25 lakh or more than that like mgm mumbai mgm Aurangabad, these are the colleges for low clinical 15 lakh would be your fee structure right now come to the fourth category which is our last category 400 to 425 marks the rank range would be somewhere between 39k to 47k <clears throat> in government through all india quota for general category non-clinical are possible except pathology that means ki if you come under general category in that case pathology you will not get but except pathology or other non-clinical branches you will get through all India quota for EWS and OBC pathology is also would also be available along with other non-clinical branches but clinical branches are not possible for SC lower clinical branches are possible for ST radio and derma except radio and derma all the other branches would be available right through state quota for general EWS and OBC non-clinical would be available except pathology for SC, lower clinical would be available. For ST, higher clinical would not be available like radio, dama, medicine. These branches would not be available. Rest of the branches would be available. Right? Now, what are the options in DNB? In DNB, for general category, EWS and OBC, non-clinical would be available. For SC, lower clinical would be available. For ST, all the branches would be available. In NB diploma, what are the options for general EWS and OBC? Lower the clinical would be available. For SC, except radio, all the other clinical branches would be available. For ST, all the branches would be available. Now, if you don't want to take DNB or NB diploma and you are not getting your desirable branch in NBMS through all India quota or state quota, in that case, you, have, you will have to move forward towards private or deemed now in deemed colleges for higher clinical your uh, you will uh, you will have to look for the colleges having a fee structure more than 30 lakh per annum for in private 30 lakh per annum and th the states which come under that uh, uh, under uh, that fee structure i mean the uh, you will be getting the uh, higher clinical under 30 lakh per annum so the states which is having Approximately that fee structure is UP, then Rajasthan, Chhattisgarh, Pondicherry, these are the states. For mid clinical, your fees would come around 20 22 lakhs per annum. For lower clinical, the lower fees would be your options like 10 lakh, 12 lakh, 13 lakh, like that, 8 lakh also. And if you don't want to go for these of the states or in uh, private colleges, then deemed would be your option. In deemed for higher clinical, you will have to look for the colleges having a fee structure of more than 40 lakhs per annum for higher clinical for middle clinical all those colleges having a fee structure more than 30 lakhs per annum like for mid clinical means surgery and all i'm talking about for lower clinical anesthesia ent optal these for these uh, branches you will have to look for the colleges having a fee structure above 20 lakhs per annum so this is all about what are your opportunities between the marks range of uh, uh, students getting between 400 to 500 right uh, again i want to make you aware that if you wanted to have discussion with us you wanted to ask your queries your doubts you should attend the 
zoom meeting because the zoom meeting is completely dedicated to the counseling before counseling starts we are continuously regularly we are conducting the zoom meeting to make you aware with the procedure of counseling with the options available in front of you with the reality scenario real scenarios what are the, uh, what uh, what should be your backup and other things that you have to keep in consideration about documents and all we are, are already discussing uh, discussing we have uh, uh, already conducted three to four uh, three zoom meetings so probably we'll be conducting regularly uh, to make you aware re regarding counseling each and everything we're gonna share at the same time if you join our telegram group you will be getting all this pdf which i am uh, just explaining here in the videos all this pdf a stipend bond state wise uh, discontinuous bond each and everything you'll be getting in uh, in a telegram group so that group could be could become useful to you also so uh, that's all for today at the same time uh, lastly if you have any doubt query you can call us also uh, you can message us on whatsapp thank you so much for today thank you so much